803 on the dot and we're following breaking news after an hours long standoff in Central comes to a deadly end. It all started when officers tried to serve a search warrant and ended with a suspect dead. Fox Carolina's Grace Runkle has been live there all morning with how it unfolds right now. Well, the town administrator here in Central says it all started yesterday around 2.30 in the afternoon when police tried to serve a warrant and go and collect evidence at the suspect's apartment. Shortly after that, he opened fire on the officers and eventually turned the gun on himself. Here's a look at that scene from yesterday. Again, it started around 2.30, but the standoff lasted for several hours. The town administrator says police entered the apartment, announced they were there, and then began to go up the stairs. That's when the town administrator says that the suspect fired three shots from one of the bedrooms at the officers. They did not return fire and instead left the apartment and tried to make contact in other ways. He wouldn't respond. So we ended up sending a robot in there, and one of the rooms the robot couldn't get into. So the extrication team went in that room, and he was there already dead from the self-inflicted gunshot wound. The official time of death of that suspect will come from the coroner, but investigators on the scene yesterday say they believed that he turned the gun on himself shortly after he fired after those officers, and that's why they got no response from him when they tried to communicate with him following that. SLED is now a third party investigating the incident, and we're working right now to find out when the suspect's autopsy is going to be scheduled for, because not only will we find out the time of death from that, we're also expecting the coroner to release his name. Back to you.